do you feel Tim Zhu has the skill to nullify your active left hand? I don't think nobody in the world has the skill to do that. You know what I mean? I think I think he, I think what he can do is is um, pick his spots to, to to be better in for me to slow my to slow to slow it down. But no nobody nobody has the will or, or nobody has the the, the wits or skill enough to stop it. What dangers do you think Tim Zoo possesses poses for you? Um, I mean the, the dangers that anybody possesses for me the the just toughness the the grit. The high activity, the the pace, um, you know, you know the same stuff that that mostly everybody that comes to fight me possesses when they come to fight me. On fight night, which Tony Harrison turns up? Is it the boxer or is it the brawler? Which one's going to turn up on fight night? Expect the unexpected, and I told y'all that from the beginning. Expect the unexpected. How do you feel about Tim Zoo's claim you made yesterday about your body being skinny and prone to being, you know, prone for body shots and broken bones? Uh, I don't know if that's Tim just talking shit or not, but. Never had a broken bone. Never been knocked down with a body shot. So if, 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 that, if that's his key, um, if he felt my body weight, probably, he probably felt that I was on weight. Do you think Tim is a basic fighter? You made that claim, and what is your kind of uh, thought behind that statement? I mean, I mean basic, basic means um, that he does nothing that nobody doesn't see with the naked eye. You know what I mean? That's, the, that's what a basic fighter does. You know, he just... Like I said, one gear straight ahead, pressure, 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 throw as many shots as I can, take as many shots as I can, give harder shots than I gave him. And you know, it's just just a basic fighter, man. He just he just shows me nothing the high level of skill of, of a setup for a high level skill fighter. Tim thinks you've you've underestimated his boxing ability and then said on March twelfth he's gonna shock the world. What do you say to that statement? He gotta show us. I mean he can all he can he can speak it all he wants to, but Come, come 10 days from now, he's gonna have to show us. You know what I mean? Like it's, eventually all the talking goes in one end out the other, and you gotta show us. Yesterday, Tim Zhu said he could probably beat you by either boxing you or fighting you, dragging you into a war or outboxing you. I mean, how do you feel about that? I think, I think we got a guy talking about, a, a, I think you got a, a confident fighter talking and speaking on himself. So I, 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 you, wouldn't, you shouldn't expect nothing of him speaking volume, a, a, a hiatus about itself. So that's the way Tim should be speaking as a championship level fighter. He should be speaking that way. So talk, talk, talk yourself up. How many levels is Tim stepping, stepping up to fight you from his last Ten. Fight? Say that again. Ten. Fucking ten. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I'm, I'm, probably, I am, I'm, I'm, I'm the only fighter that was a world championship fighter that he's fighting. He hasn't fought a world championship fighter yet. How does how does Tony Harrison nullify Tim's power? Um, I th I think like I, I think people are giving him more credit than he deserved when it comes down to the power aspect of it. Um, he just went ten rounds with Terrell Goucher or twelve rounds, however many rounds that fights was, but he went twelve rounds, and Tim showed up most of the time. I mean, Terrell showed up for most of the time, so Terrell definitely felt the power, and I'm, and I'm pretty sure he's not a weak kid, but. To sit here and act like he cost the zoo, mm, mm, I, th I think we're giving him just a little too much. Do I think he's the strongest? Nah. Do I think he hit harder than Jamel? Mm, nah. Do I think he hit harder than her? Mm, nah. So, you know what I mean? Like, come fight night, man. He's going to have to just show us, man. He got to show us, he got to prove to us, and he got to show us. What does victory mean to Tony Harrison? Uh, man, that just puts me back where I, where I know I, I deserve to be, man. You know, it's, 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 it's going to be bittersweet, man. It's going to be bittersweet to, for me to do it um, and to come to Australia and do it like, you know, Devin Haney did it and like all the other guys and, 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 and Terrence Crawford did it and, you know what I mean, and Tony Harrison is next up. So it's just, it's going gonna, it's, it's gonna to be, a, it's, I'm going to relish the moment, man. I'm soaking it all in. I'm busting my ass. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not leaving no... T's uncrossed and no I's undotted. Timothy. Oh, Timothy. 24-hour flight, Timothy. Don't think it's all for nothing, brother. Get your two-hour workouts in. Get your two-hour runs in. Be prepared, my brother. Because I, I ain't coming over here for nothing short of what I'm coming over here for.